Good morning and welcome back to the Higher Grounds Podcast's Morning Minute Meditation. Thank you for joining us on this morning. The last time that we gathered together, we began to deal with the subject of Acts 13.36, where the Bible said that David, after that he had served his generation by the will of God, fell on sleep and was laid unto his fathers, and the Bible said that he saw corruption. I am interested in this this um, fact that it is an obligation of a believer to serve the generation that the Lord has allowed him to be a part of. Jesus said he came not to be ministered unto, but to minister and to give his life a ransom for many. If we're going to follow in the footsteps of Jesus Christ, then we're going to have to give our life to the service of other people. There are four things in Acts chapter number 13 verse 36 that I think are very important things to remember. Number one, David was a cherished man. The word David means cherished individual. And oh my, how David was cherished by the people of God. He lived his life in such a way as a servant to the people of Israel. And they cherished and loved that man with all of their heart. And if you will serve people, you will find that your life as a cherished individual will be a blessing to those around you. Secondly, the Bible said this, that he not only was David, but the Bible said simply this, that he served his generation. In other words, he was a contributor. He was serving them. He was contributing to their lives. Many people today are doing more taking than they are giving. If you're going to serve your generation, you must be a contributor. Then he was a committed man. The Bible said that he served by the will of God. We, you and I, must be committed to the will of God if we are going to follow the example of Jesus Christ and be conformed to his image, Romans 8.29. And then finally, he was a man who completed his task. He did it until he fell on sleep. Stay faithful, steadfast, unmovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord. And until next time, God bless you from the Higher Grounds Podcast.